Okay, so um, on filming this, that Aussie is very, very, very light. I mean, we probably, you know, Aussie extra that colour, you know, I might get 10 tins a year. So we're going to open another one. Royal Belgium are the only company in the world that I buy pre-packed caviar from as well. And I do that because actually, particularly with Beluga and particularly with Savruga, the egg is very soft. So if you can buy it from the fish straight to the tin, you're gonna get a much better product. But to do that, you really have to have 100% confidence in the farm you're buying from. I've dealt with Royal Belgium for a long time. I have exclusivity for the UK and I trust them explicitly. So that's why I buy some pre-packed. So this Aussie, I do it because I've opened it, um, should perhaps be more of a representation of the colour. So let's see. This is a 125 gram. Yeah. That's much better. That's what you would expect to see with with Ozietra. Uh, has a nice sheen on it. Very well packed. Um, and I was just about to taste it with a knife, but I'm told by Annabelle who's um, filming this, do not taste with a knife. You're supposed to be using rubber of pearl. So I'm going to use rubber of pearl. And this, that's exactly what you would expect to see with the, the, the Royal Belgium. Actually, if anything, I prefer the taste to the lighter caviar. Um, I think it's fresher, uh, it's brighter, um, and it's very, very creamy. The thing about raw Belgium caviar is two things. You get that taste of a lot of cream and butter, um, and also the taste lingers, and that's where they stand out from many other sturgeon farms, the taste lingers, um, and that's exactly what 